What's good you guys welcome back to my youtube channel please make sure you subscribe so that you get notified next time I post a video Now Singer Bahati has finally come through and addressed everything that fans needed to know concerning his fallout with Peter Blessing Now in an almost 2 hour video which he posted through his youtube channel Bahati talked about several stuffs among them being where his fallout with Peter Blessing started Him taking Peter Blessing to court as well as the reason why he had to take down on Peter Blessing song. Yeah, by the way, number three is the one which people were concerned about so much. It was heading straight up to the reason or the beginning of his fallout with Peter Blessing. Now, but he came through and said that Peter Blessing had totally changed. You know, he had become another person due to his behavior at the workplace, you know, high level of indiscipline, as well as having so much time for ladies, which is not a bad thing, you know, the Georgia economy and stuff. Anyways, but he came through and and said that this guy had gone as far as having so much time for ladies compared to the time for work plus money for some snacks on the road but this guy chose not to go and when Bahati tried to reach out to his mother her reply was the one that put him off bro yeah because Bahati came through and said that Peter Blessing mother said that hey mtoto wangu sahi ni mkubwa amejua kujitaftia mumake aliniambia mtoto wangu ni mtu mkubwa na ni mtaftaji ni si yeah, and the next thing that Bahati saw is Peter Blessing saying that he is out of EMB Records and asking for fan support in his music. Yeah, that is how the fallout between Bahati and Peter Blessing started. Now, heading straight up to the reason why Bahati had to take him to court. Now, after this guy said that he had walked out of EMB and is asking for fan support and stuff, he went ahead and looked for lawyers after being misadvised. That is according to Bahati. Yeah, and these lawyers went ahead and served Bahati with a notification where they had said that this guy should pay amount of 1 million to Peter Blessing because of the money that he has pumped into the company within I don't know a specified period of time, bro. Take notice that within 14 days from the date of this letter, if you fail to pay the said cash 1 million to our client as demanded. And Bahati was like, wait a minute, how will I sit here being threatened to pay this money within a specified period of time to the guy whom I have used a lot of my money to support in his music industry and that is when Bahati decided to go to the court and he had Peter Blessing arrested and he was leased 200 Kenyan Bob cash bill. Are we clear up until there? I guess so. Now, heading straight up to the reason why this guy decided to pull down Peter Blessing. Song, he explained something called the trademark of Peter Blessing. Now, Bahati came through and said that Peter Blessing is an artist name which EMB itself came up with. Yeah, and Bahati came through and said that the brand name Peter Blessing belongs to EMB and there's no way Peter Blessing could have used that brand, you know, to earn money or to get sympathy from public about the name because EMB Entertainment named him Peter Blessing. You cannot use it when you breach the contract unless the company signs it off. Yeah, because at the center of push and pull between him and Peter Blessing, that is when Peter Blessing was misadvised again according to Bahati and told bro, everybody is talking about you on the internet. If you release a song right now, it's gonna hit. It's gonna be a hit song. So Peter Blessing rushed and he made a song and a video to it. Yeah, and Bahati was like, Peter Blessing is a brand name which belongs to EMB Records and there's no way that guy can can use it to get sympathy or to earn money or to do anything with it without the legal termination of the contract with EMB Records. Until then, this guy won't be able to lease any music without Bahati taking it down. Yeah, at least he came through and addressed several stuffs which many people did not know about his fallout with Peter Blessing. Yeah, because everybody was against Bahati, Bahati, Bahati. But he came through and said, well, I have been ready to help this guy, but 
anaka ni kichwa ngomo anyways man i don't know what do you guys think have you watched the video by bahati you can go look on his bahati kenya youtube page and watch the whole video but i'm telling you i've just simplified for you because it's a very long video right there almost two hours but i had to watch it so that i can give you summary of whatever he talked about in the video anyways i don't know what do you guys think go ahead and drop your thoughts down in the comment section don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel Follow me on Instagram, blissguy.ke, and kamokawaina. I'm gonna be back with monies.